my drink spilled. Because his little thing in my purse knocked my purse over. I didn't see it. It went all I over me, and he backed up and just looked at me like, ooh, don't get it on me. I'm dry now. Even with the clumps. Even with the clumps. Even with the clumps. <sighs> oh man, we're on camera. All right. So today. Today. Derby day. Yes. Derby I'm so day. excited. I love Derby day. I think because Derby is like it has a special place in my heart. <laughs> because it's like that's where I started. <laughs> Like that's where I started, like at becoming lifestyle. So like for Derby. So Derby was your bottom, and now you're here. Yeah, exactly. I started at Derby. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. Did, uh, did, you, did I tell you the story about me and Brian going to Derby? Mm -mm. I was like, I heard of Derby in Portland for the first time. I was like, I don't know what it is, but I've heard of the Kentucky, the Kentucky Derby before. I'm like, let's go. I show up wearing like fuchsia and blue. He's in like black and gray. Everybody loves me all day. He was super jealous. He was like, I would never come back here again. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I feel all the time. We're never going back here again. <laughs> he's like, we're never coming back. No, he literally, he's like, bro, he's like, I would never let that happen again. <laughs> and that's every day. Females, males, everyone was like, oh, I like your outfit. Oh, I like your outfit. Oh, I like your outfit. And for me, at an event in Portland like that, I was like, okay, maybe I'm onto something. I got, you know, people yeah. randomly. Yeah. So that was like a start. And then the next year, I was actually a part of it because I helped pick the best dress. Then the next year, I was like, you know, the whole group, I did, like, all their fashion, like, the uh, polo, uh, dinner in Blanc, the white party, the polo mm -hmm. noir. So, like, but Derby is, like, you know, where I started. Then you're, like, I'm really just styling these people's lives. I'm really styling these people's lives. That's how the life, you know. Change my name. Change my name. <laughs> a new moniker appeared. But today's going to be fun. Cause I, Super fun. Maple and Ash is going to be a, a good time. I'll be talking probably more, way better now than I will later on. Just as a, as a warning. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so we're going to Maple and Ash in Scottydale, mm -hmm. Old Town, Derby Days. They're going to have contests. They're going to have Best Dressed. They're going to have probably mint julep, special drinks. We're going to eat. And uh, yeah, just buy. I think the real question is, should we get the whole fried chicken tower? Or yeah. do we get individual entrees? No, the fried chicken tower was her idea. It but looks it looks so amazing. Good. I think you get waffles with it too. You get waffles. You get a whole fried chicken. You get hot honey. You're, you're on glaze. the hot honey. You're on the hot honey. I love hot honey. That's because I'm hot honey. Okay. We're done. No, we are. We're keeping We're going. Done. No, but you know what, though? The, one of the things I think about that is, like, do I want to... Is that a lot to eat in, like, a derby outfit? Like, a, a whole fried chicken? Like, is it going to be messy? That was actually like one of my thoughts said, about it. Like you said, though, they're not going to plop a whole entire whole fried chicken on the thing on the tower okay. it's going to be sliced up okay I, actually i kind of want to see someone order it before us like, well you know, we're like, getting like, there an hour after you know what I mean? brunch opens like kind of like purview like check out the table see what that food is is that something that i have no idea what it is i mean i know what fried, i mean i know what it is but you know what like how it comes out why don't we google it i don't know if we have we, that's a good idea we might see photos I'm other Googling than that they, right have, they have tons of good stuff they have uh i want the um what was it, lobster. the lobster? The lobster's, like, egg thing. Soft scramble. Soft scramble, so. We'll see. Either way, it's going to be a good time. Um, she wanted to get the champagne uh, tree that serves 8 to 12 people for two of us. I felt like it would save money because it was, what, $1.35? <laughs> it was $135. Yeah. For at least so 12 eight. Drink, for 12 drinks, for I think. 12, 12 champagnes and one cocktail is, like, $22, 22 to $25. So, you know. I felt like it was a great deal. So, Plus, I mean, when you walk in, you get the free cocktail. We think. The welcome. Well, that's what they normally do. That's what they used to do, but they changed their menu. So I, we They're don't, not going to not do it. They're going to uh, give us a mint julep. Okay. Well, we'll see. And then the last one, not only did we get a welcome drink, but we also got a free glass of champagne. So, that was two drinks already. Again, with the previous menu. Yeah. But we'll see. Because uh, that day wasn't any more expensive. I think it was regular price for uh, for when we went there for that um, day was gas seventy dollars. Yes, yeah, so seventy dollars for brunch included 
one entree and then all, all you the can eat like what was it prime rib? It was like prime, prime rib, rib, potatoes, rib beignets, beignets, potatoes, uh, biscuits, scones, something scones, like that. Scones, scones. Yeah, it was yeah. fine. And the bacon. And bacon, yeah. which is like a great deal. Yeah, I no, think I so got the Dungeness crab Benedict last time. Now that I think about it. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. But either way, we're probably gonna be drunk, and uh, it's gonna be a good time. But before that, we have to drink our coffee, and go work out. Ah, get ready, get sexy. Got to earn this fried chicken tower. Exactly. Shoes. Juicy curls. Juicy curls. Juicy curls. What do you mean? Juicy. Juicy what? Curls. For what? Oh, they said hair curls. Oh. <laughs> Don't include that. Little baby popped up in my DM. Say she in town for the weekend. Can I see you tonight? Now I'm drunk, speeding on the 580. When I get it, I'ma go crazy. Uh, I'ma go so hard for you, baby. You just don't know how bad I want you. And now we up in this room, and I'm touching on you. But deep down, I still feel so confused. Call it insane how I be doing the same. Shit, thinking something's gon' change, but at the end of the day, I never learned my lesson. I just can't leave her alone, and I know that I'm wrong. Cause she's gonna pay for it later with a broken heart. Me? 
Point, but you know, and just trying to knock the bottle out of my hand, of course. Again, all she does is spill shit, <laughs> spill the mint jewel, which is Dang it. mint jewels aren't the They're business, so good. He just they aren't like the business. Soda. Nah, they nasty. No, he doesn't Don't like nobody it. tell you otherwise. So, it's a reason why they only have it for one day of the year. <laughs> it's just nasty. Um, and I'm not a club soda fan, but it's just nasty, no, he's a liar. and so, but you know. Party just got started. Derby day. Scotty Dale. Maple and Ash. Best dressed couple. We out.